Hey, what's up, guys? I have an HVAC video for all of you. As you can see by the title, yes, today I'm going to be turning on my 2019 Carrier Performance Series 80% gas efficient furnace for the first time for the 2024 2025 heating season. Before we turn it on, let's check all of the main components and make sure everything is working properly. So, here we have our vacuum switches. This is to determine to make sure pressure is present in the heat exchanger. And by that, we have our draft inducer fan motor. This motor runs at 3000 RPM, 120 volts, 60 hertz, and it is a induction type motor. This is obviously a cooling fan to keep the motor nice and cool as it is moving. So right here we have our flue pipe. This is to extract all of the toxic fumes. And right here is a high temperature limit switch. If this pipe gets too hot, that switch will trip and behind there is another high, uh, high temperature limit switch, and this is for the heat exchanger. If the heat exchanger gets too hot, it'll trip and shut off the furnace. Right over here we have our gas valve, and as you can see, it's in great shape. And of course this is powered by natural gas, as you can see right here. And of course we have our five burners. Right over here we have our flame sensor to our right, and to our left is our silicon nitride igniter. This will obviously glow from 120 volt power, and then that will cause the gas to ignite. It glows at 2000 degrees Fahrenheit, which is definitely enough to ignite the gas. So, yep, this furnace is ready to go, and I recently put a new filter in about a week or so ago. So, without further ado, let's get this furnace fired up for the first time. Alrighty guys, this is the furnace running with all of its components working properly. Drop producer fan motor is working the way it should. Vacuum switches are properly going. Flue pipe extracting all of that toxic fumes. Our burners running very nicely. Basically this is the combustion chamber. As you can see the flame rod is that. That's to send a signal to the control board that there is a flame present in all five burners. So, yep, there you go. This furnace is still running quite strong, despite only being five years old. So yeah, this furnace is running really nicely. If you did enjoy the video and the commentary, then please be sure to like, comment, rate, and of course subscribe, and thank you all very much for watching.